today we are in uh, chemistry department iit bombay and one phd student with us <laughs> from professor krishna p f kalyapans research group miss anisha so miss anisha please introduce yourself myself anisha suresh uh, yeah. i am now fourth year phd student at professor krishna p kalyapans lab i am from kerala i have completed my bsms dual degree graduation from isa bopal mm. that's all yeah, that's, <laughs> that's all <laughs> So, when did you started your research in IIT Bombay? I joined for PhD in Jan 2021. So, this is uh, uh, during a COVID during period. COVID period, and uh, luckily I was able to uh, get into IITB campus by February 2021 only. So, so um, first my question is that what motivates you to come in a organic synthesis field, individual? Like I have done my. Uh, BSMS project uh, in biochemistry. Okay, so, so this is totally contrast to biochemistry, or it is similar I don't to know, that? Uh, like uh, natural products synthesis. Uh, from this uh, natural products synthesis only, we will go to further drugs. So I, I was interested in uh, knowing about how to synthesize this natural products, and final, uh, finally, maybe during postdocs, I will be uh, trying to study regarding the. Um, so uh, apart from this uh, preparation of drugs yeah. and uh, its activity in biological systems so apart from this just slightly away we, we i want to ask you in isar you people used to go abroad for their research work hmm. so why you selected india and particularly iit uh, yeah most of the people after bsms degree they used to go for uh, abroad even many of my friends have gone abroad yeah. So, uh, I preferred uh, India just because, um, huh, like little bit I am homesick. Okay. So that if I am at uh, abroad, it will be difficult for me to like uh, frequently go uh, if I am not feeling good with the environment and culture. all. Okay. Hmm. So you don't like Western culture? Most? Huh, I am mostly used to Indian culture, okay, but I okay. am ready to go abroad that's now. Okay. <laughs> For postdoctoral studies. Yeah. Okay. So, how was your experience during these three years during in IIT? Hmm. The experience was good enough. Like, do you like to... this campus? And what special thing? Yeah. In this campus. Greenery. Greenery. Apart greenery from greenery, what, and, is uh, what about the infrastructure about IIT? Infrastructure compared, compared to ISIS, this is very old. Okay. So I was a little bit disappointed when I joined the lab first. Okay. Because the uh, yeah, infrastructure were uh, completely a little bit old compared to that of ISIS. No. But now since I am used to it and since uh, I have uh, uh, like uh, developed the uh, good rapport with the lab mates, I'm feeling okay with this. So you are now comfortable in IIT mm -hmm. campus. So how was the food and homes? Your accommodation so this, uh, in IIT. Food, is, food and accommodation is comparatively better oh. to that of ISIS. Like um, here we have been provided four time meals. At ISA we were yeah, getting I only three time meals. So what's mm -hmm. in your research? You facing the challenges during these three years. This most. Hmm? What is the difficulty you faced in the, during research? Difficulty? In my case, I am facing difficulty in aldol condensation. Oh, that is your reaction related research. Okay. Okay. So, I hear you are a PMR fellow, right? So, this is one of the prestigious fellowships from India. So, how you get that fellowship and what is the protocol to go get that? Like. Uh, I got selected for PMRF uh, in the lateral entry stage, that is after 6 months of uh, PhD. Still it is then, there or it is now changed the protocol, government changed the protocols for that? Now I am not very sure, maybe after this cycle some protocols are going to get changed. Yeah, it is actually so, changed. Hmm. So I got uh, selected through lateral entry program, that is uh, in IIT case, after completion of 4 courses, uh, which is around 34 or 36 credits. Yeah, so how uh, much you get? And with uh, eight point, uh, more than 8.5 CGPA, uh, we can apply for PMRF. I was so, having 10 CGPA. So you are 10 pointer. So nice. <laughs> so you are a scholar. <laughs> so, so you are like this from your childhood or 
from here coming here you will get the 10 point like 10 you are point? a top ranker from childhood itself uh, not like that i was having good grades in academics you are scholar from childhood itself <laughs> we are considering okay <laughs> then so how tell me about your professor how is he is he interacting is uh, very cooperative in my case like whenever i am facing challenges he is helping me a lot Good. I'm uh, so much grateful so for that. So this is for all professor in uh, IIT B, or this is slightly different in your case for your professor. So it is depends upon professor to professor, right? Uh huh. In my case, is very cooperative. I'm yeah. not sure about how other professors so, are. So two things you mm -hmm. like in IIT, and mm -hmm. two things what you dislike in IIT. That's important. So just tell us about. This. Two things I like in IIT. I like the greenery. Okay. And then. Yeah. Then what? What about the whatever you told that you got the ten point? What about the education, the academics, and so? What about your? No, 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 no. course work during your PhD. course work was i was it? doing mostly uh, from home up to mid sem i was at home so how was the teachers in that time with uh, online uh, courses online so there was okay because uh, since the classes are recorded and we can see it again and again that was a little bit beneficial because sometimes when we are in offline classes sometimes we will be missing out some points so uh, during uh, phd hmm. what things you have to do in iit From initial to your depends, hmm. up to depends. What things you have to do? Like uh, there will be course work. There will be some pattern. Like mm -hmm. you have to do some TA courses, mm -hmm. some uh, TAs you have to do, technical mm -hmm. duties, or any other things you have to do in during the phase. So in a sequence, what is the activities? Like after getting admission, uh, for the first six months yeah. we have to do uh, courses. Uh, like uh, I think in my case uh, we were having six courses, out of which two were mandatory courses and uh, other uh, four were optional. Okay. So optional courses our sir only suggested according to the requirements of our lab. Then after that uh, one seminar course was there which will improve our presentation skills and other things. Then uh, laboratory course was also there, but in our case we did not get exposed to laboratory conditions. Sorry to interrupt you. Mm -hmm. Just. Tell me, this courses, whatever you selected, mm. is that beneficial during your research? Sure, it is. So good. Then uh, uh, there was laboratory course. In our case, we did not get exposed to laboratory. Uh, it was uh, online only because mm -hmm. of the COVID conditions. Then uh, after six months, uh, we can start working in the lab. Before that, we 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 can interact with our seniors, and um, we will be able to. There will just for special huh. interactions hmm. like hi hello. But I started working from uh, March uh, uh, only, like uh, I was getting trained from most of my seniors. So I go to know. So there is a culture in IIT, or is it is specific to your lab? Like seniors will train to juniors, or you? Most are... of the places it is like seniors will be training the juniors. In even in uh, during our uh, so project time. So how is your time, lab lab? Mates or lab seniors, they are cooperative for you. Yeah. In your case. Yeah. Uh, they were good to me. Uh, like, it depends on how we are uh, with our seniors. So you have to be interactive. Huh. Okay. Since uh, how, however, we are in uh, like in what way we are interacting with our seniors, the same we will be getting back. So it just mm -hmm. give by one hand, take it from another hand. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Sounds good. Uh, Then, apart from uh, this, after uh, course work, what is the pro process to go up to defense? Then uh, after seminar course, uh, then we will be um, co uh, almost uh, completing one year of PhD, and we will be doing the registration, PhD registration. After that, we will be getting our RPC committee members. Uh, two so of there the, will be evaluation after one year. Yeah, after every, one year? every year there will be frequent evaluation, and um, uh, be as a PMRF for me, it is like once in six months I am having evaluation. So that is separate, and institute separate. is separate. PMRF so is having separate. one year review, and uh, institute is also having one year review. So PMRF is monitored by New Delhi or uh, any other place. Now it is uh, Chennai. Okay. IIT Chennai. So they have personal com committee, and they will mm -hmm. interact. It with uh, uh, like uh, it will be from every institute. Uh, people who are specific to our area. Okay. They uh, will according take, to that, they, uh, they will take our evaluation. Hmm. So 
Bombay. So after that, you have to go. There is like JRF to SRF. That things are there. Uh -huh. So when it will be get converted? In case of uh, PMRF, uh, like we don't want other external committee members for conversion from JRF to SRF. Uh, just after second APS, um, once we have given second APS. We will be promoted to SRF, and our fellowship will also so increase from yeah. Our fellowship will also increase from seventy thousand, which was previously so to seventy five thousand. So it is a hmm. big inspiration for all. Yeah. To get the PMRF, it is seventy yes, k, yes. right? Yeah. And 70K. it will be high after two years to eighty k. Eighty. Seventy five, and then third year it will be uh, getting high uh, to eighty k. It is a big hmm. inspiration for all. Hmm. Hmm. So after that, uh, you have to give depends at five years, or it will be extended. We can uh, PMR fellowship won't be extended at five years maximum. We will be getting fellowship. Okay, but what so, about the work? Hmm? It will be complete in a five years, or it sometimes. It I am works. hoping it will complete by five years. So wishing you best luck for your work, and thank you for your. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you, thank you so much, Jodu. <laughs>